If hiking is your thing and you know you need sunglasses, but you don't know where to start, you start here, you're in the right place, stick around. Hello and welcome, I'm Eyeglass Tyler. I wanna to talk to you about what to look for in the best pair of hiking sunglasses. I wanna go over uh, frame features, what you wanna look for in the frames, and then some lens features, what lenses would be a good idea for this activity. If at the end of this, you are interested in buying, then definitely don't forget about old Sporter X and certainly don't forget about our See Better Guarantee because with that, you're never stuck with something that you don't like or just doesn't work for you. You actually have as long as 45 days with them, even if you get them in prescription and we will take care of you no matter what that means on our end. Also, by the way, we have opticians who are very friendly, very knowledgeable, who'd love to help you get it right the first time. So you can always reach out to us if you want even more information or more specific to you recommendations we would love to help you reach out to us. All right, let's get into this. When it comes to frame tech or frame features, what you want to look for, obviously something that's comfortable, something that's lightweight. I usually recommend something that has grip either on the nose or in the temples or ideally both. I think the best thing you can say about a pair of eyewear is that you can put it on and you can forget about them. You don't have to fuss with them. You don't have to adjust them. You don't have to think about them. They just perform for you. They help you see, they help block the sun and you don't have to think about them. That's I think an amazing trait to find in a pair of any kind of eyewear really. Uh, some people really like wrap around frames. That's gonna give you better uh, protection, of course, from light, no matter where the sun is at, but also gives you more unobstructed vision. It's not to say that you have to. There are some people who aren't as fond of the cosmetic look of a wraparound style, but if you do like a wraparound style, that can be very beneficial. Of course, it's gonna give you the best protection. Uh, another thing that I do recommend is going with a nylon frame material. It is lightweight and it also holds its shape even in more extreme temperatures and uh, it tends to be a little more comfortable, a little more forgiving, a little more flexible, uh, but of course very durable and that's a big deal as well. Hey, if you're liking this content, but maybe you have additional questions about hiking sunglasses or perhaps you have prescription needs, be sure to reach out to one of our very friendly expert sport RX opticians because they are eagerly awaiting your call. And for even more hiking frame reviews, unboxings, prescription hiking content, check out our videos and our blogs. We'll put a link in the description below. When it comes to lens tech, I think contrast enhancement is amazing. I think that you really should go with something that helps to improve and boost contrast. And with that, you're gonna be looking at colors like coppers or browns or even rose, rose coppers, bronze. Uh, colors in those categories are going to be good for you because with the contrast boost, it's gonna make it easier to read and understand the terrain. You can better spot things like potholes or divots or where the ground just kind of disappears. Uh, it also helps to make things prettier. I don't know, it makes colors more vivid. If you don't like the idea of something contrast enhancing and you're looking for something that just blocks a ton of light, you can go for a gray or that gray green. Sometimes you'll hear G15 or a gray green smoke. That's gonna give you a little more muted colors. So the it really just helps to minimize light transmission, gives you more true to world color, but maybe a little more I don't know, muted, I guess. Uh, some recommendations in terms of the contrast enhancing options, and this is gonna be more brand specific. Maui Jim's HCL Bronze is like my absolute favorite lens, especially from Maui Jim, but also pretty much across the board. That is gonna be a contrast enhancing one. This is another good time to talk about uh, a, a feature, a lens feature, and that is polarized. So polarized lenses, Usually we don't push too hard for hiking because it can affect your depth perception. There is an element of polarization uh, in the polarizing filter because it is cutting light on a plane. It can affect some people's depth perception and that isn't a good feature to have in a pair of hiking sunglasses. However, from Maui Jim, their proprietary technology with their polarized plus two uh, polarized tech is very impressive and I've found that the feedback I get from that is uh, minimal to no people complaining about that depth perception issue. So that's why it landed on this list. 
Another really good one in this, especially if you want more light transmission, that is the Prism Trail Torch. And the Prism Trail is a proprietary lens tech coming out of Oakley. Trail is very light and the, tr uh, the Trail Torch is a little bit darker, but this is gonna be a good option if you want really big contrast boost, uh, but not as much uh, blocking of light transmission. So this would be good for if you're hiking in more tree cover, you have a little more shroud or in, in overcast conditions when it's not as crazy bright sunny, that lens is amazing. Also the Chromapop bronze mirror is another good one that's coming out of Smith. Uh, and that is another really good contrast enhancing lens. And those are some of my top recommendations. So that wraps it up for some of the broad overview things to look for in a good pair of hiking sunglasses. I hope that you have a little better understanding of what to look for and that you are much better equipped for buying something that'll work for you. If you are interested in any of these styles, stick around for just a moment longer. We'll have an easy to click shop now button. If you do have any questions, you can definitely leave them in the comment section below. We would love to hear from you. Uh, again, if you are ready to order, don't forget about that Sea Better guarantee. I really think it gives you a ton of peace of mind and if peace of mind is your thing, don't forget our opticians because they would love to help you and they would love to be a resource for you to make sure you get it right the first time. You can always reach out to us. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope this was interesting or valuable information. If so, throw us a like because it helps us out, you guys. You can find relevant videos over here and we have great content on our social media outlets and you can click that button right here. It'll take you right to it. We have cool stuff. I think you'll like it. You should check it out. If you are ready to shop, you can hit this button right here. That is gonna let you get right to these frame styles and uh, shop away. Thank you for watching.